Good morning or good afternoon or good evening or good night dear Swissies and Switzerland lovers and of course all your nature lovers. Um, one of you asked me lately in a comment um, if I could do a walking tour in Lungern. Yeah, Lungern is about 20 car minutes from Brienz and as it is probably the only sunny day <laughs> this week I have to produce many videos and um, that's why I am here today I was around Brienz in the early morning I will be in Lungern now and in the afternoon I will go to Iseltwald so enjoy my walking tour but first of all we have to search for a parking place that's why I drive down here there is a big parking but beware in summer yeah it is uh, totally full I think after 10 yeah parking place is full but today yeah it's easy okay are you ready for the walking tour around Lungen it's just behind me so let's go maybe you remember that Lungen has a lake <laughs> but as you can see the lake is still very low because they need the water for electricity yeah but I think in about mon one month the lake will be full again it is still cold I don't know if you can see my breath <laughs> it must be about yeah five degrees yeah, very cold and uh, the dandelions yeah have their head clothes closed yeah, because it was raining and uh, it's still too cold for them I guess <laughs> so they need some time to wake up yeah maybe we're lucky enough to see them with open head huh wacky wacky there is a tennis court here do you play tennis? No, I do not play tennis. I played once badminton, but it's not very good for the bones. So I stopped. <laughs> Today I only walk. It's healthy too. Yeah, but spring arrived in Lungen too. Maybe when we are here long enough, we see the flowers growing. You can see clearly how low the lake still is. And you see some people there. These are fishermen or fisherwomen. Yeah, because uh, Lake Loon is full with fish. And what you see over there, the mountain and maybe the cable car. This is Turen. Yeah, I stayed there in uh, winter when it was almost winter. And I will stay up there again when spring arrived. Yeah, but it will take some, some weeks again. Oh, everything looks so fresh and green and intense and I swear it is not a filter this is how Switzerland looked like when it got a lot of rain because then nature can grow fast and that's why everything looks like in a fairy tale And of course the, the flowers on and at the houses are not that various right now because it's just starting. Ah, but we have some, how you call them? Tulips? Yeah. Ah, oh, very nice. Look at all. I see.
It is the early morning. It is about, uh, I guess, nine o'clock, or maybe eight forty-five, quarter to nine. <laughs> yeah. So there are almost no people here. It looks bad, huh? The lake. I'm very sorry, but you asked to do a walking tour around Luwen, and this is the reality right now on the 26th of April. One of you also asked for some Swiss German words. <laughs> and I'm thinking about telling you about how you say, hello, mm -hmm. <laughs> how you say hello, or how you say grüezi, or when you say grüezi, or when you say hoi. Hoi is a kind of a very personal a uh, way of saying hello. So hoi, it means like uh, we are very close friends. And uh, grüezi is more for um, when you don't know uh, yeah, the other person, then you say grüezi. Or in Bernese Oberland you say grüezi. <laughs> yeah. Shall we repeat? Grüezi and grüezi in Bernays Oberland Swiss German because there is not only one Swiss German there are many many dialects slangs <laughs> yeah so now we're walking to the island yeah which looks more than another landscape but I make a promise now I will do this hiking or walking tour again in a few weeks when the lake is filled with water again. Did you know that once Lungen was also here? Yeah, with houses and cows and everything. And then they decide to create a lake, yeah, for energy, you know. And uh, then they have to, they had to sell their homes. Yeah, it's not over. But yeah, it is many years ago. So I hope that they are happy again. And that they have new houses somewhere else. For once Rasta is not with me. I thought it's maybe not that relaxing. <laughs> to do a village walking tour. Yeah, this would be P, this would be his part, but the rest is not that relaxing. Neither for him, nor for me. But I was uh, out with him in the early morning in Brienz. That was amazing. Yeah, I will put the link now, when you look above on the right side. Yeah, there you can see this amazing morning video from Brienz. Wow, that was crazy nice. So now we are at the wonderful island or half island of Lungern. Yeah, we do a little round walk. <laughs> ah, it's, it's beautiful, even though there is almost no water in it. But of course, when you look at it now and you would see green here and green here, it would be more beautiful. But we take it as it is. Gal? Oh, crazy gras. Yeah. And also on this side, they're working on something there. tree. It is a Trauerweide, oder? I guess so. But you see, the trees here are not really green. They're still in a kind of a winter sleep. Huh? Ha, huh, interesting. Very interesting. And on this side, yeah, the same. 
It's just started. Uh, this is why I do often the same uh, videos, because they're never the same, you know. You are in the same place, but it always looks different, because the light is different and the vegetation, vegetation is different. The lake is low, the lake is high. Yeah, so clear. Yeah. This is why I almost don't want to go away from from my uh, home, also from my home area. My home, I call my home area Bernice Oberland because it is so beautiful and it is different every single day. Yeah, another fisherman over there. They put fish in. I don't know at what time. And then they grow. Splish, splash. And they got kidnapped by fisher men <laughs> and women. Yeah, that's life. Yeah. They give it and they take it. Oh, look at all the light over there. Ooh. That's crazy nice. Yeah, and now with lake, <laughs> it would be much nicer. Huh? Yeah. I don't know if I told you, but we have uh, now enough water. We had a very dry winter season, but after all the rain we got in the last few weeks, yeah, Wasserpegel had sich normalisiert. The water is uh, enough right now. It looks like a big construction site. Or are they planning to create another island maybe? That would be interesting. Huh? Yeah, we will see it in a few weeks. I don't know what they built here. Okay, we go back. Tension. <laughs> yeah, keep your inner child. Yeah. Very important. I love this mountain over there. But I forgot the name. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's not enough space in my brain for all the names and all the mountains and all you know what I mean okay now we go back and uh, we walk the hiking path near the lake huh I just read that they do a renovation from the first of May uh, where I came from here so you can probably not walk here in May I don't know what, how long does it takes, but yeah, you will see. But you can walk over a little bit above. Yeah, there are many ways going through Rome, girl. <laughs> I keep recording because ah, it's got it's got so schön. It's nice and beautiful right now. These green boxes are for the dog business, you know. <laughs> and then the Leons. Yeah, still closed. But they're working on it, look. Yeah, they're working on it. To show us the beauty of their heads. Ah, here, it's written, you see? Sanierungsarbeiten. But they do not write how long it takes. I don't know. We will see. Ha, 
how it looks so bad. Huh? Yeah. But at least you can compare later when I record the other video in a few weeks. Then you can see the difference. Huh? Deal? By the way, this is a very, very nice walk. You could walk around Lake Lungen, um, but uh, not the whole way is like this. There is a big part uh, near the, the road. Ah, it's a little bit noisy, but uh, yeah, the rest is okay. The rest is here, you know, you walk the whole way around. Yeah, a lot of traffic in summer, of course, but yeah, right now I'm almost alone. What are they doing here? Huh? I would say they create an island now. Why do they put wood there? Ha. Well, does huh? Maybe I see a person who's working there. Then I can ask. Oh, look at them all. How nice. Huh? Ooh, the nice part is coming. Yeah. I'm so looking forward when the lake is back. And you see on the peaks, there is still snow. It is not unusual that we have snow on the mountains, on this altitude. In April, everything can still happen, you know. trees over there and the airplane Yoo -hoo. yeah <laughs> there's always an airplane or a helicopter where is it look here an old one you see it yeah very small of the meadows. It's incredible. Yeah, I'm sorry when I always use the same words. Um, the reason is my English is so bad <laughs> that I only need the words I really know, you know? Yeah, there are coming new words in my vocabulary. But yeah. I don't want to, to speak something wrong, you know? <laughs> yeah, so I just keep saying what I know, what it means. Isn't it boring to watch me walking? Huh? But I heard some of you said my videos should be longer, so that's why. I just keep recording. What's it? Yeah, yeah. Ooh, nice tree. What is it? Apple, bitter, zwetschke. I have no idea. I have no idea. Ooh. Look now. Yeah, that's nice, huh? Even nicer with more water. You can't win all the time. Oh, another nice tree. How ah, good looking. 
Ja. Oh, de, oeh, de colors doen we er. Very cool. Huh? Yeah, spring is really nice in Switzerland. I love spring and I love autumn for the colors. And I love winter for the snow, of course. Ooh, it's still cold in the shadow. Yeah, but soon we are back in the sun. Yeah, and then I hope that I can show you the famous train from one of the most beautiful train rides in Switzerland. And there are many. <laughs> yeah, many crazy nice train rides in Switzerland. We go up now a little bit. Yeah, to see another angle of Lungen. Ooh, yeah, not so bad, right? Yeah, cool. Oh, with the snow-covered mountains, look at I zoom in. Yeah. Really hübsch. Huh? Yeah, except of the renovated house. <laughs> but yeah. By the way, if you get lost somewhere in Switzerland, just follow the yellow sign spots. Yeah, and you get somewhere. Huh? So they are very good. Oh, everything is so fresh and green and it would be yellow if I wouldn't be that early and don't ask me where these spots exactly are try to explore nature around you with your own eyes I'm totally not fan from, uh, how you say, from all these um, photo spot points, yeah, which a tourism organization do, yeah, to lead the, the tourists. So just think by yourself, <laughs> maybe. Yeah, and then you, you will find something unique, you know? I tell you now the difference between these yellow flowers, which are not dandelions. Dandelions are here. Yeah, the other ones are butterbliamli. Yeah, that's the reason why I don't have Rasta with me on this walk. Because I know that there are many dogs around here and it is very uncomfortable to walk here with Rasta. Yeah. It, it's anyway not comfortable for me either. I don't like it when I don't know what the dog is doing. But the best is you can, the best you can do is just ignore it. Yeah. You know there are also many people which are afraid uh, of dogs, but you can see clearly that this dog is afraid too. You see it? Yeah, he's totally afraid. Yeah. So just keep calm and go further, okay? What you hear now, the noise, is the noise of military airplanes. You can also hear it here in Lungen. It's 
just on the other side of the mountain. Do you know what I love on producing videos on YouTube? Even though they have not that much views, but I know that the people take their time to watch it. Yeah, that means that they are interested in Switzerland. They are interested in what I'm talking about. And this is... Uh, I think very important in these days because normally you just swipe 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 yeah you look at something for one second and it's gone and what I try to teach is that people learn again to dive into something yeah like in, in a walk like this because this is what is relaxing your brain. Yeah, the other stuff with swiping is not relaxing for your brain. It is stressful, you know. I need to be careful a little bit because the, the ground is wet. Yeah, I have to take care about my foot. Yeah, but it's okay. Just be careful. Oh, yeah, that's a nice view, huh? Yeah, I told you. So, yeah, that's why I'm very thankful when you watch these videos. And then you know you have the same values. When I started documenting what I do now, since many years it was just about showing Switzerland but in the meanwhile I try to put a message in nothing nothing spectacular just yeah what I told you before that we should be uh, more aware what we see and what we let into our minds and brains. Yeah. There are so many, we have so many depressive people in Switzerland. And I ask myself, why? How does he mind? Why? There is so much beauty around and so many sad people. It's so crazy, huh? Right? Yeah, they should go more out, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, for me, you know, something like this, going out into nature and take a walk is totally uh, relaxing for me. Even though I'm, I'm talking and I need to be concentrated on what I record, but it's totally relaxing. Yeah. Even though I'm breathing like a horse. <laughs> we are in the shadow part again. But time is working for us. Yeah. As longer the day, as drier the ground, and as shorter the shadows. By the way, I had ice on my car window this morning because we had a clear night. Yeah, and when it is a clear night, yeah, stuff can frozen. Or can freeze. Yeah, that's why. Ooh, nice, huh? 
Now we wait for the train. Train, check. <laughs> and yes, you are right. This you never gets old. Huh? You can watch it over and over again. Oh, and the mountains are still covered with so much snow. Yeah, this is the special etwas, was? Yeah, the thing, the special thing. It's not a bad walking tour, huh? Even though the lake is low, but there is so much to see. The, the dandelions are, yeah, really hard working on opening their heads, huh? Yeah, I guess it is not a bad place to live here, huh? Fresh air, a lot of nature around you. And what I personally love is that you can see the mountains from here too, yeah? Ah, oh, you know, when I, when I drive once uh, to the flatlands, I miss the mountains. Yeah, it's, it's flat. <laughs> it's too flat for me. <laughs> ah, I know. Yeah. The problem is when you once are used to see the mountains, yeah, you will be obsessed about them. And then you miss them when they're not here. Of course, this is a personal opinion <laughs> yeah if you would talk to a yeah to someone who's living in the city you would say what mountains for what are they <laughs> say hello to some goats hey goats hey how are you? Hi. Oh, you have a great life here, huh? And the view, I mean... Yeah. It's not so bad. This is now the rail station of Lungen. Yeah. Yeah, it's a rail station. <laughs> Nothing spectacular. So, and now... I will show you probably the most beautiful decorated house in Lungen. Yeah? Be prepared. Are you ready? We are soon there. Every time when I am here, I have to check this house because they usually have wonderful flowers in the garden. Oh yeah, look. It is like a little paradise. I had a little talk with the, the uh, owner of the garden we saw and it's so funny when you ask people uh, about their passion they always like to tell you uh, something about it 
Yeah, and so I know something more <laughs> about some flowers. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I'm curious what will grow next in this garden. Yeah. I always like to talk with some people when they look friendly. <laughs> yeah, not everyone is, is in the mood to talk. But uh, yeah, when you ask their, them about their passion, normally they talk. And I always think when I see um, uh, children in such environments, how lucky they must be. You know, I grew up in the, yeah, in Greisfeld in Zurich. We yeah, a very bad circle and it is so different. Um, I think they, they have just a, a, another background for their lives. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. I oh, had liebt so oft zu I would have loved it to grew up in the countryside. Yeah. But I, I came out not that bad, other. <laughs> oh look, it's Vergli. Oh. oh dog. <laughs> oh. Yeah, be aware. Dogs everywhere. Oh, that's a nice garden. You know what it is written? In diesem Garten glauben wir an Märchen. In this garden, they believe in fairy tales. So, so. Vogelhochzeit. Yeah, waiting for the birds. <laughs> ah. I love that. And you know what's written there? I zoom in. Blumen sind das Lächeln der Erde. Flowers are the uh, laughing from Mother Earth. You probably see now why Rasta is not with me on, on village walks like this, because there are dogs everywhere, cats. Oh, look, it's mini golf plots and cats everywhere. This is a mini golf playing place. <laughs> playing place. You know mini golf? Oh, I was very good when I was a teenager. Yeah, I love to play it. It's kind of golf, but on a smaller place. Yeah, that's why it's called it mini golf, other. Yeah. Nice. We soon arrive now where we started. Yeah. Maybe we go down here. I don't know. Maybe we have to go back again. But it's a nice place. You can do some picnic here. Huh? Oh, looks good. At the end of our walk, the dandelions are awake. Yeah, it's all yellow everywhere. Yeah, what a nice end.